Lawrence Schaller here. We're at Pro Strength and Fitness where I am training and kind of get all my strongman training done. I'm just going to quickly show you a few of the, the implements that I have at the gym and that I'm able to help prep myself for World's Strongest Man. So, the first thing we've got here is um, the Farmer's Walk. There's two of them. One sneaky one down here as well. This is kind of these events you basically have to lift them up and run as fast as you can with carrying heavy weights. These weigh 50 kilos each. At World's Strongest Man, it will be about 400 kilos in total that I'll have to be carrying. Um, and at Europe's Strongest Man, it was even heavier than that actually, it was 450 kilos um, and I managed to win that event. I tend to be quite good at the moving events. Um, the other moving event that we have here is the super yoke. This attaches to the farmer's walk, just clips it on, onto in here, you just get some clips in there and then it's on your back, you stand up with it and again it's a sprint as fast as you possibly can. I tend to like all those kind of events. Some of the events I'm not so kind of keen on but I've worked hard on over the years. We've got the Atlas Stones here up to pretty high platforms as well. You can see that platform over there is six, over six foot. So it's lifting them fairly high. It's actually higher than the platforms we use at World's Strongest Man. I got that made that high on purpose just to help me train a bit harder. But um, I've been getting better at those. We have various different things. The tires here, I tend to use these just for conditioning. They're quite big, but um, I don't actually find them too hard to flip. So it's just more fitness work. Um, we have the dumbbells, this one, weighs 100 kilos which is about 16, 16 stone and you have to clean it up to your shoulder and then press it overhead with one hand. We've got a lighter one here as well so you can kind of build up to it. This one's about 35 kilos. Kegs and sandbags for loading events. Um, these are kind of again a fitness uh, event. You tend to have to run about 20 meters with each implement. Sometimes on sand which is horrible. Just kind of drains the legs completely. But um, it all depends on what events I have coming up. So my training changes depending on the competitions, but I've pretty much got most things I need here and um, I'm happy training here.